You may be right, I may be crazy, but I just may be the lunatic you're looking for. Penny here, GhostPixATS.com, the number one sports consultant in the business, Thursday, March 18th, tournament time. Tournament time, and I want to know who's going to win it all. Drop it in the comments. Who's winning the tournament? Somebody help me win my bracket, please. Somebody help the Ben Dog win his bracket. You know, tell me some sleepers. Hit me with some upsets. Tell me who is going to be in the final four. Who will win the national championship? And don't forget. This tournament is special. For me, it is anyway, because last year we did not have the tournament. All right. I've been doing a lot of reflecting back to last year, this time. There was so much unknown. None of us knew what was going on. We just knew that it wasn't good. There was fear. There was panic. It was crazy. But you know what? If you're here now watching the Ben Dog, you've also made it through the pandemic thus far. So, and then if you've been affected by COVID-19 in any way or lost family members or lost your job or lost your business or anything like that, I feel you, man. I feel you. I feel you. I feel you. I hope you, uh, you know, I hope the best for you moving forward. If anybody who's out there been affected by this, we've all been affected by this, but I mean, like, 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 like directly affected by this. I feel for you. But, uh, yeah. So anyway, thank you for tuning in here today. Let's get to the bacon. Let's start a making the bacon anyway. So NCAA basketball, uh, tournament is starting. <clears throat> starting today, we have some really good college basketball action. So the NCAA tournament uh, package is 100 bucks. You get on with the Ben Dog, you get the whole tournament for 100 bucks. Can't beat it. The soccer package is 100 bucks till the end of May. I got a few packages up for anybody who wants to rock with the Ben Dog, but yes, the college basketball tournament package. Now is the time to jump on if you haven't already. It's 100 bucks and you get the whole tournament till somebody's clipping the net. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> and don't forget, help me win my bracket. Drop it in the comments. And while you're there, if you're new to my page, welcome. Take a second out of your day. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Tap the bell right next to it. You get my videos as soon as they pop up. And then follow me along on Twitter at Benny Beast Row. At Benny, Benny Beast Row. B-E-N-N-Y-B-I-S-T-R-O. Uh, yesterday, I pushed it, put, bleh, yesterday, I pushed in soccer. I stank again yesterday, guys. I did. I did. So uh, I did hit two down days in a row. Okay. That, that, that happened to me one time so far on this current hot streak, which has been running from about February to nah, maybe end of January even till now. You know, we've been really hot. I mean, another time I hit two down days in a row. I think I might've hit three down days in a row and then psh, right back to it. We picked right back up and we went right back to being hot again. So don't worry is all I'm saying. You know what I mean? I lost on the Bulls money line. I lost on the Clippers uh, who were downright awful last night. Real bad, real bad, you know? And then I won on the uh, Warriors. The Warriors smoked the Rockets 108 to 94. And I think Curry exited that game too last night, but for real, um, the Rockets are a dead team. I've been watching them. There's no life in the Rockets. There's nothing, you know, there's nothing they can do. PJ Tucker is now gone. I don't even know if there's anything they want to do. You know, I think they want to get the year done and just start fresh. You know, it's been an ugly year for the Rockets. PJ Tucker is now gone, like we talked about. Uh, he's on his way to uh, Milwaukee, which I think is perfect. I do. I think Milwaukee could really use a piece like PJ Tucker. You know, it, 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 he's gritty. He's, a, he's He's that guy. I mean... Uh, and it's de de great defensively, you know, I think it, it's perfect for Mil Milwaukee. And, um, I just like the landing spot. The Rockets are going to be fade city all year. They are that bad. But the problem is we're going to see 20 point spreads. We are, it, it may be difficult to just keep betting against the Rockets. It's going to be 16 points, 17 points, 18 points, 19 points, 20 points. We're going to see 20 point spreads. So we have college hoops today, right? Uh, 
We have some playing games. We have some really good playing games tonight. We really do. Uh, I have a premium play at 6.30 p.m. Eastern time in college basketball I'm excited for. You can look it up. You'll know the game. I also have a play in Michigan State, UCLA tonight, too. And then I have NBA. Uh, and I'm, I, I get, I'm, I'm just I'm excited for the college basketball. I really am. So if you're getting on board, let's go. Top tier play will be in college basketball tonight. And I want to run another college basketball play, so I'm going to do it right now. Free play. Let's go 8.40 p.m. Eastern time. Let's go Appalachian State. Versus Norfolk State. Free play of the day. We're taking Appalachian State minus three and a half. Winner of this game gets Gonzaga, if I'm not mistaken. Gonzaga. Sorry, Gonzaga folk. Uh, and to me, well, and not just to me, to everybody, Appalachian State was off this year. They weren't good. They were, you know, they had a down year. Uh, I'm on App State almost every year. It's just one of those teams I enjoy. We're used to seeing them uh, be very good offensively, you know, which they were not this year. Um, I enjoy betting that entire conference, usually. App State comes into this Sunbelt Conference uh, tournament, and they just start winning. You know, they were, they, were, they were not good. They were not good. They come in, they start all of a sudden winning. You know, they start hammering. They start hammering three balls. They start just hammering, and they get it done. They get it done. And see, this is where I'm at with this, okay? App State, again, not good this year. They weren't. As a matter of fact, I think they finished under 500. But then they come to conference center time. Uh, they stepped it up and played ball. They got the job done. That's how I feel about tonight. Uh, they're going to get it done. What I don't like is that hook on there, you know, but uh, uh, the three and a half. But uh, I like App State here in March to get in. They must land the three ball tonight. When they're hitting threes, they win the game. Norfolk, on the other hand, has been pretty good. They have. They've had a little COVID issues or something like that. But let me tell you, you know, just because App State won this Sunbelt gig, don't get it twisted. Norfolk is a good team. I think they have now won their last six or something like that. I'm certain people are going to be riding Norfolk today, uh, Norfolk State today. I know people are heavy on the under in this matchup. But I'm going to ride App State uh, right here on YouTube. Free play of the day, Appalachian State minus three and a half. NCAA basketball tournament special with the Ben Dog, 100 bucks. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. If you want to get linked up with the weekend with Benny, $124.99 and get everything included. Hit me with an email, benny.ghostpicksats at gmail.com. We'll get it in there. And then, hey, as always, good luck. God bless. Grind on, baby. Cheers.